He was the safety officer at Hillsborough on the day of the disaster. It was his decision to reduce the number of turnstiles available to fans at the Leppings Lane end. Today, Graham McCrell was sentenced to a fine and families of those who died expressed their anger. They came home to the loved ones in a wooden box. They treated disgracefully the vile things what are said about them and all what we get after 30 years is £67.70 per victim. Graham McCrell was responsible for security arrangements at Hillsborough. He decided to open just seven turnstiles to admit over 10,000 supporters. Last month he was found guilty of a health and safety offence. Mr McCrell's actions did not cause the deaths of the 96 victims, but it did contribute to creating a dangerous situation. In the aftermath of the disaster, he was the official chosen to brief the then Prime Minister Margaret Thatcher on the events of the day. He even appeared on television just hours afterwards to give his account. It definitely was the situation that there was a great build-up of Liverpool supporters trying to gain access to the ground, uh, getting nearer to kick-off time. What do you define as an emergency situation? Uh, no comment. The court was told he always cooperated with investigations into Hillsborough, but when he was arrested, he answered no questions. The victim's family say that is hard to forgive. Operation Resolve interviewed this man and he refused to answer any questions. 22 questions were put before him and he refused and he gave a written statement. And what we've just witnessed in that courtroom is an absolute farce. As well as a fine, Mr McCrell was ordered to pay £5,000 in costs. Damon Green, ITV News, at Preston Crown Court.